Hello everyone. Today we will discuss the current affairs of 16th and 17th March. So the current affairs of today's are based on biggest loss billionaire first dark sky place top smart city rankings world vaccination day. So go to the first question. Yes Bank will resume its full banking services from. So all of you know about Yes Bank crisis. Yes Bank started its operation through giving corporate loans. But normally a bank started its operation with retail loans and now the advance increased to 334 percent between 2014 to 2019. So the crisis happened and it will resume its full banking services from tomorrow means March 18 and MD and CEO of Yes Bank appointed as Prashant Kumar and founder of Yes Bank is Rana Kapoor. Next question is state celebrated Phool Dei festival in India. So Phool Dei festival is a significant harvest festival in Uttarakhand. Phool Dei is a reverence paid to the gods for the good crop year. It is on this occasion little girls decorate the threshold of the houses with freshly picked flowers. So the state which is celebrated Phool Dei festival in India is Uttarakhand and the CM of Uttarakhand is Trivendra Singh Rawat and governor is Bebirani Moria. Capital is Dehradun. So next question is the fifth country to successfully isolate the strain of COVID-19. So you know this COVID-19 corona virus disease 2019 spread various nations and you must take some precautions like avoid going outside if no necessity is there. Wash your hands with soap before eating. Use mask while going outside. Drink a lot of water. Get some sunshine and do regular exercises for which you will prevent yourself from this virus and the fifth country to successfully isolate the strain of COVID-19 is India, the first country is China, second is Japan, third is Thailand and fourth is USA. The next question is who own the men's open title at international tennis International Table Tennis Federation Challenge plus Omen Open. So here is the picture of Sarath Kamal whose age is 37. So see this man who won the Omen Open at the age 37. So don't give up. Read constantly and believe in yourself and he defeated Marcus Fratius to own the Omen Open. Next question is who was appointed as the advisor to Jaman Kashmir Lieutenant Governor Girish Chandra Murmu. So all of you know that Girish Chandra Murmu is the Lieutenant Governor of Jaman Kashmir. Now an advisor also appointed to him 
here is a picture of girish chandra murmu and the advisor who is appointed to the governor of girish chandra murmu is basir khan next question is national vaccination day celebrated on all of you know vaccine vaccination should given to the baby at the right time and all you see on television the amita bachchan's polio advertisement ek bun zindagi ke so sorry do bun zindagi ke so this vaccination day celebrated on 16th of march and india became polio free on 27th march 2014 next question is which city are the top in smart city rankings before this ranking the ranking came in in a year now it is two times in a year so the this year the top smart city now is agra which is in up and the second is ahmedabad and cm of uttar pradesh is yogi adityanath governor is anandiben patel next question is world consumer day observed on answer is 15th of march and the theme of the world consumer day was the sustainable consumer next question is the book masiha modi a tale of great expectations written by so every exam you see a question on author and book so masiha modi is written by tablin singh country that declared hand sanitizer and mask are essential items so due to covid 19 the hand sanitizer and mask prices are nearly double or tripled due to high demand so government has declared it an essential item for which the price will be stable or balanced so the country is india so india declared hand sanitizer and mask are essential items next question is name of the new species of discovered tree hopper is named after so a new species of tree hopper discovered and that tree hopper named after lady gaga of usa all of you know who is lady gaga and on her name the hopper tree hopper's name is kai kai gaga so next question is who was recently nominated by the president to rajya sabha so you see the picture and he is ranjan gogoi the former chief justice of india after the retirement of kts tulsi a senior lawyer ranjan gogoi nominated by the president of india to the rajya sabha so the tenure of rajya sabha is 6 years the tenure of the member of rajya sabha is 6 years and lok sabha is 5 years and rajya sabha is also called a permanent house go to the next question which country became the first in the world to be recognized as dark sky place so dark sky place is an area usually surrounding a park or observatory that restricts artificial light pollution the purpose of the dark sky preserve is generally to promote astronomy so the answer is new so this is the country this is an iceland country and it also new to you new is new to you so niu you new is an iceland country the capital of uh, new is alofi and the currency is new zealand dollar next question is which railway which railway station has been selected 
by the government to build a world class railway station so the government has declared to make the railway station to a world class railway station and that railway station is new delhi railway station and cm of new delhi is arvind kejriwal and governor is anil baijal next question is who has been nominated as a director of the central board of rbi so the answer is debasis ponda and about rbi rbi is established in the year 1935 april 1st and rbi is the apex bank of india it is also the bankers bank of india next question is india will provide assistance to nepal for construction of three schools so all of you know the relationship between india and nepal from ancient times so to keep this relationship for the future india given rupees 10701 million nepalese rupees to nepal for the construction of three schools and for educational developments in nepal so the capital of nepal is kathmandu and currency is nepalese rupee next question is who top the biggest loss billionaire in the world so in the recent bloom bloomberg billionaire list amazon's chairman amazon's founder jeff bezos become first then this man who is now the biggest loss billionaire in the world is bernard arnold is in second place and bill gates bill gates was in third place so bernard arnold the biggest loss billionaire in the world next question is india placed how much towards a covid 19 emergency fund so every organization international organization many countries funding to control covid 19 which is now a pandemic in the world so i again tell you if you are going outside please wash your hands use masks and drink a lot of water to prevent this virus so next question this is dollar 10 million so india placed how many how much dollar a dollar 10 million placed for the emergency fund next question is gst council has fixed the percentage of gst on mobile phones so recently gst increased on mobile phones so definitely the mobile phones price is going to increase so it is uh, to from 12% to 18% and full form of gst all of you know is goods and services tax and gst day celebrated in india on 1st of july and first state to implement gst is assam and first country to implement gst is france and we are following the canadian model of gst and the committee that uh, recommends to introduce or to implement gst is vijay kalkar committee and the brand ambassador of goods and services tax is amitabh bachchan so thank you so much for watching like and subscribe my channel cs patnaik cp classes stay tuned